So, uh, Silvina and Bill, it's very nice to be here in Beijing. We are now at the opening of the fourth conference on, on Cordex here in, in Beijing, starting now here in October. Uh, and it's uh, very nice to be here, of course. And you are the co-chairs of Cordex. And I would like to ask you first, uh, what are your expectations for, for this conference? So we start with you, Silvina. Okay, actually uh, we have a very, very strong expectation because uh, Cordex is, uh, is uh, facing a new challenge uh, phase uh, with the, the, the changes in, within the WCRP structure. So we have to fit into the new uh, implementation plan structures and we have to, to think how to evolve. To, to fit with the with what it expected from Cordex and uh, to to advance in the Cordex community. Okay, and uh, Bill, do you, do you have anything to add on that, or do you want to maybe say something about the Cordex role for for IPCC, perhaps? Or? Well, um, I would also add that, that the WCRP has developed a very strong interest in Cordex, and so it's gratifying, it's a big challenge for us as well, and the IPCC has done that as well. Uh, in my experience with the IPCC, we've seen uh, this time with the sixth assessment report, there is a huge interest in making sure that Cordex uh, results become part of the IPCC report. So uh, a lot of responsibility that we have in, in, is part of that, but it's, it's, it's very gratifying to see that, that our community has evolved to where we are viewed as being extremely important. Okay, thank you. And uh, maybe just a short question also. Do you have any s specific expectations on some scientific talks here or anything in the program especially that you want to look into? You start with Bill this time. Um, well, um, I, I think that uh, there are a number of different areas of research that are going on. There's, there's a wide range of activities. Uh, I hope I can catch up with some of them. Uh, I think Filippo Giorgi's historical overview and his view towards the future set a, a nice stage for all of that with convection permitting modeling, with the earth system modeling. Uh, I, I, I'm looking forward to seeing what people have done to advance in those areas. Okay, and Silvina, do you have anything special? Uh, I agree what, uh, with Bill. Uh, there is a huge amount of pre presentation, orals, posters. Uh, we, we will try to go through all of them. I don't know if we will be able to do that, but uh, some of them are very challenging and very um, pushing the limits of what Cordex has been already achieving at, up to today. So it's, it's a great opportunity. Okay, thank you very much. Now we just look forward to the rest of the conference. Thank you.